This is a fast tutorial on how I prepare my uh, clean audio for voiceovers. So I'm using Audacity 2.0.3. I'm going to check that I've got my microphone working, which is Logitech H360, which is a USB microphone. Then I can start the monitoring just to make sure that I can see the red bars. Yes, it's working. So I'm just going to record something, and I will be pausing. So I do this. One, two, three. Four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, and 10. So all I've done there is recorded a track with some numbers, and you can see that if I pop it down to the audio track on waveform, you'll see something like that. The, I would say call the train track things here, I would call something when I was not speaking. So I'm going to show you three things to get rid of these. What I do, it's not necessarily what everybody does, but it's what some people do. So I'm going to select a piece of a track there, uh, just to get the bit where I was not speaking, and I'm going to do the effect of noise removal. So step one is get a piece that is already uh, you want to get rid of. So get noise profile number one, I've selected a portion, that is fine. Okay, then I'm going to do control A, and I'm going to select all, and effect, same thing, which is noise removal. This time I'm going to do step two, which is get rid of it. Click OK. And you'll see that there are white lines now, which are very like, thin. Then I'm going to do two other things. And one is to normalize the track. Click OK. Goes like that. And final one, I'm going to compress it, which is compressor. And click compressor. And click OK. And that is it. So if I played it back, it should sound pretty okay with me going one, two, three, four, five, etc. And it will sound good. So that was the end of the tutorial. Remember, I was using Audacity 2.0.3. If you want to save it as an MP3, then you need the layman coder, which is on their website. So good luck with that.